Uh, I again condemn utterly the wanton act of terrorism carried out against workers uh, in Algeria. Uh, I'm very grateful for the sympathy and condolences that Senator Carr and others have extended to us. This remains a fluid and evolving situation, and many details are still unclear. But the responsibility for the tragic events of the last two days squarely rests with terrorists who chose to attack innocent workers, murdering some, and holding others hostage. Our priority remains at the moment to identify exactly what has happened to each British national caught up in this incident and indeed to help other countries determine what has happened to their nationals. We've sent additional staff to Algeria. We're in close touch with the Algerian authorities and with BP. We're working to ensure that those who survived this ordeal are properly cared for and reunited with their loved ones and that the families of all those involved receive full and accurate information and support. This terrible incident of terrorism has highlighted again the threat in North Africa and the Sahel from international terrorism. And working with our international partners, we will maintain our resolve to see that threat countered and defeated, and Al-Qaeda denied a foothold on Europe's southern border.